Good morning. <clears throat> so it's Monday, the 23rd of August, I believe. Um, wow, these glasses look so ugly on me, but I love them. They have cheetah on the side and I got them from Plato's Closet. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm wearing my Hello Kitty two-piece set today with the sweatpants. It's like not really that hot yet. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna wear this and be comfy. I am running quickly to the bank because I need to get some temporary checks. Um, update on the selling of the house. It is listed for sale now. And um, Sorry I left you guys on a clip a cliffhanger last time, but I will update you now because you know what? <sighs> whatever. Like, my husband wanted to, like, keep it, like, hush-hush, but honestly, like, whatever. It is what it is. There's literally a big-ass for sale sign in front of our house, so our friends know, our family knows, so whatever. Um, it's listed for sale as of last Friday, and we've had five showings so far, so we're waiting to see if there's any interest and what else um we found a house that we really like up north oh i didn't tell you where i was moving we're moving up north oh my god um so yeah we're planning to move back to massachusetts and if you don't know massachusetts is where me and my husband went to high school together um, we visit there every year so you guys see the vlogs of us in Massachusetts and the last time in June when we went on vacation it was just like really hard for us to leave like we just really missed it you know and I know it's like all of a sudden and crazy and it's like we're moving across the country basically um, we're just doing it because he found a really good job opportunity up there something that's uh better pay than what he's got right now and uh we found a affordable houses there and it's getting really expensive in austin to live so what we need in a house is more space i need an office um but yeah we need more storage we need more space and so we would need to like get a bigger house in general but over here the houses are literally so expensive because everybody wants to be in the austin area um and so it just all makes sense to go back plus i miss my mom so much my mom is over there and um all of my husband's family is over there except for his mom and his dad his mom and his dad is here in uh an hour away but the rest of his whole family is up there or our family and yeah we just miss new england in general um i miss having fall like i miss having seasons you know what i mean here it is just hot 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 all the time and for we've been here for about eight years maybe more and so we've done it we've lived in the heat we've been okay with it but i don't know there's just this urge to go back so that's why we're going back up north long story short and uh we did find a house that we really like so we put an offer in and we're waiting to find out i think tomorrow the seller is going to be reviewing all of the offers and then we'll find out if we got it or not so <sighs> I don't know I'm just like really really stressed you guys I'm like really stressed I also kind of like got myself in too deep with a lot of collaborations and it's really hard to film videos when people are you know walking into my house and looking at my house to buy it so it's been a little frustrating um so yeah if you see that i'm like not uploading as much as i was before that is the reason but i know you guys will understand it's a lot of stuff to do there's a long process i'm going to get these checks because oh i just spit i'm going to get these checks because um yeah obviously you need them for when you're buying a house and i don't have any so i'm going to get that and she needs to have it like asap so um yeah, but I also think I might buy some imitation Crocs while I'm over there because it's right next to uh, uh, <clears throat> It's right next to Walmart and I've been wanting to buy Some imitation Crocs just to like throw on I think I'm gonna get white 
because I think they'll just match with like every outfit. So I'm gonna do that. I've been wanting to get them so bad. Um, but other than that, that's what's been going on. It's just here, there, everywhere. Sign these papers, sign these papers. Uh, we've had Zoom calls with our realtor who's up north, obviously. And yeah, it's just been a lot. But I'm happy that I get to update you guys so that you know what's going on. Because like I said, y'all were like, wow, what a cliffhanger <laughs> the last time that I told you. So there you go. That's all I know for right now. That's all the information I have. You guys, I'm, we're winging it. We're just getting through it. Um, hopefully our house sells like at the perfect time as we're wanting to buy the other house uh yeah it's just a lot it's just a lot I hate this process so much like it's made me want to back out of this idea like my anxiety has been through the roof and I actually had to go back to my doctor for an appointment to talk about my mental health because I was not okay like I was even worse than now like I'm still kind of stressed but I feel like I'm handling it a lot better. So what we did is we doubled my doses. So I take two pills of my Abilify and two pills of my Lexapro, which means I'm on 40 grams or 40, is it milligrams or grams? I don't know, 40 of Lexapro and I'm on 10 of Abilify. So I'm doubled just to like help me get through this my doctor was like let's double it because you are a mess and I was like yeah dude I am a mess I was like crying in the office I was like I can't handle this I just want to back out like it's so much stress you know like I definitely want to do it like I want to move and I'm excited but it's also really stressful so it makes you just want to run away like when you have anxiety you just want to be like fight or flight and usually I choose flight so <laughs> that's that um I feel a little bit better um uh, with more medicine I feel like I'm handling handling it a lot better so once we get there it'll all be worth it that's what everybody tells me it's like I know it'll all be worth it once we're there but right now it sucks I hate this whole process um it's gonna be a lot of work a lot of work but We'll get through it. So yeah, um, I figured I would just vlog today. I do have two videos to film when I get home. So I'm just gonna go get this check, do what I gotta do. And then I'm gonna get home. I'm gonna do my hair and my makeup and I have to film two. Actually, I have to film one video and then the other collaboration I'm gonna be including in this vlog just to make it easier for me. Um, plus it's only two items, so. Okay, yeah, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so I got the imitation Crocs, and I'll show you guys when we get home. I also stopped at Dunkin' Donuts, because on Mondays, uh, if you belong to the Dunkin' Donuts perks, it's free coffees on Monday mornings. So I got me an iced coffee. Um, this time I got caramel swirl and almond milk. I'm gonna need all the caffeine I can get. I think I just like cope with my stress with using caffeine and nicotine. And I know I told you guys like a while ago that I had quit smoking, but I didn't. Now I'm back smoking. I've been back smoking for a long time. Please don't come for me in the comments. I just, I can't. It is what it is, but I also got a maple frosted donut because I really need to go grocery shopping and I have it. I need some breakfast. Mm, what's your favorite donut? My favorite kind of donuts is maple frosted. It is so good. And there's this other donut shop that we go to that has a maple frosted one that's like a rectangle and it's filled with the the cream like in the Boston cream donuts and that one is so good but yeah I just wanted to update you guys and I'll see you at home
Okay, so here are the imitation Crocs from Walmart. They're by the brand uh, Time and True. I got a size nine. They fit perfectly. And I love that those little circles are black. Um, yeah, and I got them in white. Super comfy. And you know what? When your toes are jacked and you don't want to show them, bam, they're hidden. So, yeah, I filmed my video. I already edited it and it's already uploaded and it's live and everything i'm going upstairs to lay down and probably watch some videos i need to charge my phone um i'm like really chilly i'm gonna snuggle in my blankets right now i'm so cold uh so i got the things done i had to get done for the house and i'm a little bit stressed still i'm just trying to chill <laughs> I just need to chill. I just need to chill for a little bit and everything is gonna be okay. So back in the car, I'm here getting the kids from school. It is so hot outside. It says 95 on my dash, but I bet you when I check the weather app, it says um, feels like 100 because it is hot. Like even my air conditioning is like can't even keep up with it i'm so hot in here uh but yeah what do you guys think of my hair curled i wanted to ask you that um the video that i filmed uh i this is the hairstyle i have it's kind of fallen a little bit which i actually really like but i think it's cute i haven't curled my hair in a really long time i'm loving the vibe it makes it easier for me to have my hair down for some reason when it's straight, it annoys me. Um, but yeah, I'm just picking up the kids from school and we got some more stuff done for the house. Some more paperwork that we had to get done and hopefully somebody will put in an offer. Hopefully I'll hear something good by the end of today. And we may or may not go to the pool today because it is so hot. I want to go to the pool. Um, but yeah, that's all I have for you. Pretty boring day. I uh, know. Um, I changed it to this outfit. This is um, on my recent haul that that's up before this one, the one that I uploaded today. It's the lovely wholesale haul, and I love this outfit. Like, I want this in every color because I just feel like it looks so good on my body. It's so so cute. I really wish they had it in all colors, especially black. I want one in black. Um, I might have to go check the website and see if they have other colors, but. Also super random, and I'm sorry that my air conditioning is so loud, but do you guys think I should keep growing out my hair or do you think I should go back to my short hair? Because I've been thinking about this for a while and I can't decide if I want long hair or if I want to go back to my short hair. Yeah, I just need, I need friend advice right here. Like, what should I do? It's cheaper to just let it grow out, but I just love how easy it is to style short hair. It's just so much easier. I love the way it looked with it. And long hair, right now it's at an awkward length, but when it gets longer, it'll be cute. I just don't know what to do. So help me out, girl. Hello, it's Tuesday, the 24th of August. Um, so I'm gonna go do a couple of Instacart orders right now. Um, and then I'm gonna go home. And I don't know, I have cleaning to do, I guess. I have to do dishes and stuff. But nothing exciting going on today, except for, there's only one thing, like we're not doing it, but it's one thing is we should find out today if our offer was accepted for the house that we want. So that's exciting. And then I think we're receiving an offer on our current house today, I think. So it could be exciting news today. It could not be, um, I don't know, I'm nervous. I have a really like yucky feeling in my stomach. And I brought a Red Bull because every time I do Instacart, like, I'm trying to, like, focus and be, like, really awake. And it's the morning, you know? So, I had a cup of coffee, but I always bring a Red Bull and a water. But I feel like I shouldn't drink it because I have, like, 
this like nervous feeling in my stomach, but I also want to drink it so that I'm like alert. <laughs> Okay, so I'm back home and for this portion of the vlog, it's a collaboration with Shape LX Crew. So I'm going to go ahead and put the name right here and any discounts and links that I have down below in the description. Here's the tag. Let me turn this down actually. Shape LX. So Shape LX sent me these two um, shaper pieces here's one i'm gonna try them on for you guys i'm gonna show you what i look like before and then show you what i look like with it on and this one has straps you can take them off if you want to it has a zipper all the way down and then it has these um like bra clasps and what i love about this piece is this covers your inner thighs and it does have that like sticky stuff so that it stays in place so it helps you to not chafe and it has a zipper here so you can go to the bathroom without having to take this whole thing off, which I think is so amazing. And this snatches you. I've already tried it on and there's the booty right there. But this snatches you, girl. Like this is gonna look so good under a form-fitting bodycon dress. This is the next piece they sent me. Here's a picture of her wearing it. So it's a full body suit and it does have a little bit longer um pieces on the legs it does have the opening so you can go to the bathroom and this one covers your bra the other one does not cover your bra so this one covers your bra here and this one you just have to pull on and then it's got a low cut v in the back and the straps uh you can move them you can crisscross them if you need to here is the booty this one is very tight, y'all. Like, I feel like it's gonna snatch me. I'm nervous to put this on because I know it's gonna be tight. All right, I'm just wearing a sports bra and some boy shorts. So here is my body before the shaper. Here it is from the side. Okay, so here's the first one. I'm not putting on the straps right now. It would just go on like this and be on the side of your bra. This one came off the back because you can switch them. So, um, whew, girl, look at my waist. Let me just put this underneath here. Look at my waist now. Hourglass. got the back rolls down and everything and then this space for the booty doesn't take away from your shape but yeah this is very comfortable here's how far it goes down so you won't chafe if you're wearing a dress which we love it, it does have a lace detail down here and they're slightly see-through right here um, I love this one. It's super comfortable. I feel like I could definitely wear this on a night out on the town if I'm wearing a bodycon dress. I don't feel like I can't breathe. You know what I mean? Like, I could definitely wear this. I feel so secure in it. And yeah, this one I love. It snatches me, girl. Look at this. Look at this waist. Look at that waist. This is awesome. Let me put on the other one for you. Okay, so here's that second one. I definitely feel snatched, but not as snatched as the other one. So this one would be more for just a like smoothing effect under dresses. It doesn't take away from your bust. It doesn't hold you too tight. It stretches a lot right here. And it also doesn't take away from the booty. It doesn't smush it down or anything like that. But this one has an open back. So this is one that you could wear with like a low back dress, which is really nice that you have options like that. 
and it feels really really comfortable definitely more comfortable than the other one um yeah i can definitely see me using this even in like rompers and stuff and it does have really nice coverage for the thighs and it smooths those as well and then again you won't have chub rub and it does have the hole down there for easy access to the bathroom <sighs> I'm out of breath, girl, from getting those on. Just wanted to show you guys those two products. I am getting more into shapewear now because of like more for like dresses. And I really love wearing dresses. So if they're tight fitting, I really do like to wear a little bit of shapewear to just like smooth it out so it just looks better and lays better. So if you guys are interested in these shapewear pieces, I really like them. The quality is really good. I'm being completely honest with you. The quality feels really, really nice. And um, I will have any coupon codes and links down for you in the description, like I said before, so that you can get your own. But yeah, really happy with these. I'm all set for date nights. Okay, so I went to Plato's Closet to sell some clothes. I'm like decluttering clothes. They only bought a few pieces, so I got like 10 bucks. The rest I'm gonna see if my neighbor wants to look through it. But I also stopped at Dollar Tree because I was next to one. And I just wanna show you how cute this is. This is such an amazing deal. I found this lace table runner and it's got like spider webs. It's for Halloween, obviously. Let's see, see how it's like spider webs and like little spiders and everything. And it was just a dollar at Dollar Tree. I just, obviously everything's a dollar, but I just can't believe that a lace table runner was a dollar. So even though I'm moving and I'm probably not even celebrating Halloween here, of course I had to get it because they're gonna sell out. Um, also in the makeup section, I found brand name. I found these two Revlon lip colors and this one is in the shade Love Is On, and this one is Rose Wine. So they're both reds, they're cream lipsticks, but they're limited edition, and I just loved the packaging, because the packaging is super sparkly and glittery, and I, I just can't resist a brand name, you know? I feel like it's gonna look really good on my vanity. Um, it, they're just really pretty, so I had to get them. <laughs> Plus, it's gonna be fall and everything, so. You know, we can start wearing reds. You can wear reds anytime you wanna wear reds, but I usually will do it in the fall and the winter, so. Oh, somebody lost their croc. How do you lose a shoe and then not realize it? That's my question. Cause I'll see like one shoe, <laughs> like all the time I'll see a shoe on the street and I'm like, how did you lose a shoe and not realize it? They had to have been drunk. I don't know. That one looks like a child shoe, though. Um, but yeah, now I'm headed home.